Dr. O, we've come under attack. Kira and Ethan are gone. Whoa, slow down, Connor. What happened? Zeltrax sent a new giant army to attack the Zords. They drained power from Kira and Ethan's Zords and transported them somewhere. I managed to get away, but Durano is low on power. Okay, let me see if I can get in contact with them. It's a long shot, but maybe they are still in communication range. Kira, Ethan, do you read me? Dr. O, do you have any idea what happened? We've been transported to some freaky dimension. I think Mezagog's trying to capture all of the Zords. Dr. O, we're low on power. This may be our last transmission. Can you find a way for us to get out of here? Hold on, you two. I'll figure out a way to get you and the Zords back. Okay, Connor. It's up to you to rescue them. First, you need to get the Tyrannozord back to the tar pit so we can get you powered up. Then we can work on getting the guys back. The creatures will be looking for you, so you'll have to be quick. On my way, Dr. O. I'll get them back. You can count on it. I know you can. Don't worry. I'll be here with you every step of the way. Connor, I'm glad that you made it back in one piece. Let's get Tyrannozord powered up right away so we can begin rescuing Kira, Ethan, and the Biozords. Mezagog's forces will be looking for us, so we'll have to move fast. It won't be easy. While I work on opening an Invisiportal, you need to get the Tyrannozord back into shape. Get Tyranno to the Red Mission Beacon. I'll give you new instructions once you arrive. You got it, Dr. O. You can walk through the tar, but it will prevent you from jumping. Your Zord can't jump while in tar. Are you ready to start mission one? Good work. It's time to get the Tyrannozord powered up. There are three power cells scattered around the tar pits. Grab all of them to fully power Tyrannozord. The physics matrix of your Zord will allow him to air jump. To perform the air jump, press the X button to jump, then press it again while in the air. Great. Tyranno's power levels have increased. Your Zord's power levels can be found in the upper left corner of your display. Now, grab the remaining power cells. Just one more power cell left and we'll be ready to test Tyranno's weapon system. Mission complete. Great work. Here are your results. You have activated a new red mission beacon. Go there and I'll upload the Tyranno with the weapon systems test. Are you ready to start mission two? Now that your Zord is fully powered, it's time to test the weapon systems. Use the square button to unleash Tyranno's Dino Blast. Wow, it worked! That's good news. Continue to test. We need to work fast. Let's do it! Looks good so far. Keep testing out the various targets. Collect 100. 
100 Dino Bolts to restore all Zords to full power. We're almost done. There are still some targets left. Use your Dino Blast to destroy all of the targets. Everything checks out. Your primary weapon tested perfectly. Mission complete. A new red mission beacon is available. Go there and I'll upload the final systems test for the Tyranno. Are you ready to start mission three? One more thing to test out. Tyranno's Ground Stomp Special Attack. I've activated your first special attack. Tyrannosaurus! Fantastic! Connor, my sensors are picking up an energy surge somewhere inside the surrounding mountains. The only problem is you will have to destroy the orange generators. Let's go! You found a Dino Claw power-up. With each Dino Claw, you will be able to unleash Tyranno's Ground Stomp attack. There's the cave entrance. You'll have to break through. You need to find a way through the boulders and into the cave entrance. Whoa! Looks like the cave entrance is clear. Head inside, but use caution. The energy surge has become stronger, and I don't know what it is. It's a lobber! Good work. You got him! Mission complete. You've collected a power morph. Collect all of them to unlock bonus sword games. Start mission. There's the first wave of lobbers. Get used to seeing them because many more are coming. You've got the hope. Destroy all the lobbers and keep Tyranno safe, no matter what. Great idea. Tyranno's special attack will make short work of the lobbers. are secure for now. Mission complete. Would you like to restart mission one? to open an invisible portal to rescue Kira and the Terrazord from the other dimension. Only triggering the portal with Terra Dinosaur DNA can bring Kira and the Terrazord through. We've got to find some Terra Bones in order to obtain the DNA. I think I found something. Yes, 
I'm projecting white beacons on your display to show the Terra Bone. Head for the beacons and uncover those bones. It's our only hope. Time to head for the back of the net. Let's make this happen. We're running out of time. Find the fastest way to get all of the Terra Bones to the Invisiportal. Sensors are still indicating traces of Terra Bones. Pick up and deliver the remaining bones to the portal. Don't give up. Head back to the red mission beacon and give it another shot. 